Hello everyone. Recently, GATE 2021 notification has been released by IIT Bombay. In that, few changes are there, especially in the question pattern. The important new change is multiple select question. As a power electronics teacher, I will take one example in power electronics subject for MSQ question. Let us look into a question. Which of the following is or line dominated converter or converters? There are four options are given here. Phase controlled rectifier. Basically, phase controlled rectifier will do AC to DC conversion. Inverter will do DC to AC conversion. Cyclo converter AC to AC converter, especially it is used for frequency control. Output is variable frequency. It can be either uh, stepping down or stepping up the frequency. And uh, AC voltage regulator, this also comes under AC to AC converter, but especially this particular circuit will control the output voltage without change in the frequency. Now, the reason for taking this question as an example, generally the student will feel that line computation means whenever the source is AC. Therefore, our first thought would be, answer will be phase control rectifier, cyclo converter and AC voltage regulator. Okay? So, generally the natural choice from the student point of view A, C and D. So, before coming to the conclusion, let us do one thing. So, let us discuss as a solution. <coughs> coming to phase control and rectifier. So, what are all different combination schemes are possible in these uh, circuits? If you write down one by one, then you can get the answer easily. For phase control and rectifiers, there is a line combination technique. Okay. Therefore, therefore, definitely option A is a one choice. Next, coming to inverter. Inverter, particularly inverter, of course, it is a DC to AC conversion, but this is one subtopic in the phase control rectifier also. For example, if you look into single phase and three phase fully controlled bridge rectifiers. When they are operating as alpha greater than 90 degree, it will be operated as an inverter. Okay? Such a circuit is called line commutated inverter. Okay? Line commutated inverter. This is a subcategory of fully controlled rectifier circuit with alpha greater than 90 degree. However, another schemes in inverter circuits are forced commutation. Forced commutation when the load power factor is lagging and load commutation when the load power factor is leading. Suppose if the same question if I modify, which of the following converters will have forced commutation? In that way, also you can select. Uh, inverter. So, inverter will have depends on the different conditions. As the conditions are not mentioned for this particular question, inverter will also come into the option. This is one subcategory because <coughs> cyclo converter, cyclo converter, when it is operating as step down cyclo converter, it has line commutation concept. And when it is operating as step of cycle converter it will have forced commutation okay forced commutation now fourth option d <coughs> ac voltage regulator ac voltage regulator will have line commutation okay therefore instead of jumping into the answer just by looking only into the source voltage 
For these type of question, the good practice is if you list down what are all the different possible computations, then you can get the more accurate answer. So with this explanation, I can say that for this particular question, all options are correct. All options are correct. <coughs> Suppose the same question we can modify in another way also. Which of the following is our forced commutator converters? Suppose the question is asked in that way, then you can say from this explanation the answer would be inverter and a cyclo converter. So for like computation, all options are correct. If the question is modified as a forced commutation, then you can select option B and a C. So in this way, MSQ questions will come into picture. Okay. So if you select only options A, C, D, that is a partial correct answer. So for partial correct answer, you will not get neither full marks nor negative marks. But it will take a little time comparatively MCQ. Therefore, you should be careful enough. Okay, even if you don't get the negative marks, that is not an advantage, but you are losing the main marks, right? So, in order to maximize your uh, uh, score in the gate exam, this is a new model, you have to practice that, okay? With this, uh, uh, this is what MSQ question. I wish you all the best. Thank you.